better it is for you. So I want the force of 2 on 1. What kind of force is that? Positive, negative. What kind of force is 2 on 1? Which way should it be pointing? Which way should it be pointing? Positive. F of 2 on 1. Now, we want the force of 3 on 1. What kind of force is that? Repelling. Repelling, so it's pointing this way, right? And because this charge is so far away, it's less. It's less. So this is F of 3 on 1. Now, ladies and gentlemen, do not confuse this. When you're calculating the force of this on that, don't worry about this. I can see some of you saying, well, Mr. Holt, this, this charge is in the way. Isn't it going to affect it? Yeah. How many of you were thinking that? Yes. Okay. Good. But when you add them, it's just going to... Don't worry about it. You got to do them separate. Yeah. So now my goal, Dylan, yeah. is to calculate... What's this? F of 2 on 1 is the same thing as what? It's the same as F of 1 and 2. So I already have that, right? Basically, F of 2 and 1 is the same thing as F of 2 and 1, right there. 2, 1, right there. So I don't even have to calculate that. It's already there. I already got that one. You see that? Is it not negative? Well, we're just doing the magnitude. Don't worry about the sign right now. Okay, don't worry about the sign. We know it's negative, but we're just doing the magnitude, all right? So now what we need is f of 3 on 1. Watch this. We need to change this to 3, 1. So now instead of 2, where is 2? Instead of 2, we should have 1. And instead of... Uh, Three point that we should have eight. So we're going to replace this with eight. <laughs> and now we calculate. At the distance, guys. Yeah, we got to look at the distance from three. Three to one. What is it? This plus that, right? So that's point five. You see, when you draw your diagram, everything is right there for you to read off. It's right there. So now, go ahead and calculate that and tell me what you get. 1.2. 1.2? Well, what do you get? <laughs> it's actually 1. I don't know. 1.2. It's actually 1.2. It's okay, let him stay there. He's robbing himself, okay? So now, we want the net force. What's the net force? F2, what is this? F2, 1, minus what? F3, 1, which is what? Let me see. F2, 1, minus F3, 1, which is what? I hear the question, do you always subtract that? No, Dylan. It depends on the direction in which the vector is pointing. This one is pointing in the positive direction. And this one is pointing in the... Okay, do you understand that? If they were both pointing this way, what would you have done? You would have added them, but they would be what? It would be negative because we take that direction as negative, okay? We define our negative that way. Maybe I should do this. That's my positive direction and that's my negative direction. Okay? So that means that anything that points that way is positive. And anything that points the opposite way is what? Negative. Are you with me? Are you with me? Are you with me? He didn't say so far, so I'm not with you. Are you with me so far? There you go. <laughs> Wait, so with me. Both, 
Overall equals one point two. It's one point two. Is this the net force? The overall force. So three one. The overall force on this chart. Three one. Huh? Three one is one point two. So one point two. And this is two point four. So it's two point four minus one point two. I didn't write it in. Two point four minus one point two. Okay, gives us that.